bum 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 breaking news due to the current worldwide events the country of Bloxburg has decided to put all its citizens in quarantine until further notice that means everyone must remain in their homes at all times unless it's in four essential items if anyone is caught breaking these rules they will be arrested immediately stay safe out there people oh my gosh Ellie did you hear that and your brother isn't even home right now. Oh my gosh, I need to figure out where he is. I don't care, I'm not talking to you. You were gonna send me to boarding school. Okay, there's an apocalypse going on right now and you wanna sit there and get mad at me because I was gonna send you to boarding school? We've got bigger problems here. Your brother isn't at the house and there's a lockdown in place. Oh, you know what, just stay, just stay here, okay? We'll talk about your belly button piercing and all that stuff later. I gotta call Timmy's mom and see if baby Biggs is still there. Oh, I hope he is. Hi, Samantha. Uh, hey, yeah, did you hear the news? Yeah, I, I know, I know, it's crazy. Hey, um, I just wanted to ask you quickly, is, is Baby Big still there? He left. He said he could walk home on his own. No, I told him I was gonna pick him up. No, no, it's not your fault, Samantha. It's okay, it's okay. I'll just get in my car and I'll go try to find him. Thank you and stay safe. I'll call you later, okay? And tell, tell Timmy I said hi. Ellie, Ellie, we gotta go get your brother. He's out on the streets on his own right now. Okay, okay, fine, I know you're giving me a silent treatment, but can you at least just get in the car? So Samantha said that Baby Big left about five minutes ago, so he, he can't be that far. Ellie, I know you're not talking to me, but please just keep an eye out for your brother. Let me know if you see him. Oh, where is he? I don't want him to be out on his own right now. What if he gets arrested for being out during quarantine or something? Where is that little rascal? Ugh, where is he? Come on, baby Biggs. Ellie, keep an eye out for him. I don't see him anywhere. Where is he? Wait. No, I thought that was him in the pizza place. It's not. Oh, there he is. Baby Biggs, what are you doing? Get in the car. Didn't you hear the news? Sup, old lady? This is not a sup, old lady. Get in the car. I need to explain to you what's going on. Just get in. Did you not hear the news? There's a lockdown going on right now. You can't be out on the streets. Only for essential items only. Ellie's still dressing like a goth. Who cares how your sister's dressed? Look, since we're here by the grocery store, there's a few things that I needed to pick up as essential items, like water and stuff. So let's go into the grocery store, okay? But let's be quick. And remember, it's only essential items only. What are you talking about? I'll explain when we get home, okay? Ellie, are you going in with us? No, okay, your sister's not talking to us, by the way. You're not coming ugly. You're not gonna help the situation. Come on, let's just go in. Ellie, just stay in the car, please. Grab a shopping cart. Oh, whoa, the grocery store is quite busy. All right, come on, baby bigs. Help me grab some of the stuff. Uh, let's grab some can of beans because this will last us quite a long time. There we go. No, no. Do not even, no, don't even look at the bag of chips. That's not essential, okay? No, baby bigs, get the chips out of my basket. It's essential to me. Oh, all right, whatever. You know what? Let's grab some water because we definitely need tons and tons of water. My right, good. No, soda is not essential. Leave that. You shouldn't be drinking. The dentists are going to be closed and I can't have you getting a cavity because then where am I going to take you? I'm going to have to pull out your teeth the old-fashioned way. Um, you could grab some fruits if you want. Do you want any? Look, um, I'll grab a couple Gatorades just in case, in case we need them. Watermelon, yep, that's good too. All right, come on, we've got everything we need. We gotta go back home now. We can't be out for too long. No, Bravix, get out of there. Come on. You don't understand how serious this is. We gotta follow the rules and the law. Come on, we gotta go. I just gotta pay for this stuff and we gotta head home. Is it a zombie virus? No. If you'll take me seriously, if I say yes, then yes. Yes, zombies. Yep, we're all gonna turn into zombies. This is Walking Dead in real life. Now are you gonna take me seriously? Come on, let's go. I gotta pay for this stuff. So we got our essential items. We didn't get any toilet paper because there was none left. But that's okay. We've got tons in the pantry at home. So we should be fine with that. Oh my gosh, I cannot believe this. What am I gonna do with these two kids locked in the house 24-7? I am gonna go crazy. I can't even keep them entertained now. What are they gonna do when they're in the house, trapped in there? I guess we're gonna have to come up with some fun activities. Maybe they could watch like the Wiggles or something. I don't know, the Teletubbies. 
I'll think of something. All right, kids, when we get inside the house, I want you guys to go sit in the living room, okay? We need to have a very serious conversation about what's going on in the world right now, okay? And I'm being serious. No more jokes or anything like that. Oh, all right, come on. Let's go inside. I already heard the news. I don't need to hear you repeat it. So I'm going to my room. What are you studying? Your belly button. Very big. You you missed that while you were at Timmy's house, okay? Eddie, yeah, just go upstairs to your room. I'll talk to you in a minute. I can't. I gotta talk to Baby Biggs. You look like a dancer at a club. <laughs> yeah, she does. And she's way too young to be doing that. So, yes, you know what? Go upstairs to your bedroom and remove that belly button piercing, okay? Before I remove it for you. Why is she so weird now? I don't know. I used to think you were the weird one, but then your sister just, I don't, I don't know. Baby Biggs, can you just sit down, please? I need to talk to you about what's going on, okay? And this is a serious conversation maybe she's prego oh <gasps> I just just sit down please <sighs> there's a lot going on in the world i don't need anything else okay so while you were at timmy's house there was breaking news that we're currently in quarantine and what that means is that we can't leave the house okay you're gonna be a grandma no what i'm not gonna be a grandma okay that's the last thing i want right now just listen to what i'm saying baby because this is very serious okay there's a sickness going around and we all need to stay home to keep everyone in the world safe okay and there's certain things that we need to do like we need to stay home only go out for essential items and we need to wash our hands and now i've seen you wash your hands before so i need to reteach you because that is not good so that means you can't see Michael? I haven't been seeing Michael. What are you talking about? I haven't seen Michael in a long time. I, I, I just, uh, look, we're just friends, okay? We're not dating. Michael is not my boyfriend. Anyway, can we go just teach you how to wash your hands, please? Hey, come over here. Let's go into the bathroom. Come on, come right over here. All right, show me how you wash your hands. Go on. First of all, you don't stand on the sink because that's going to get it infected with all kinds of germs. So go on, show me how you wash your hands. No, you're, you're not going to wash your butt in the sink. Get, please. <laughs> Baby Biggs, that's not how you wash your hands. Go on, show me how you wash your hands. No, not brush your teeth. Wash your hands. <laughs> All right, good. Okay, make sure you really get in there between between your fingers and all that, your fingernails, the back of your hands, everything. I'm fixing the pipes. No, you're not supposed to be fixing the pipes. Look, you've got to wash your hands for at least 20 seconds, okay? They say you could sing the happy birthday song twice, and then that's long enough. 20 seconds? Yeah, but just sing happy birthday to yourself. Then, then, then twice, and then you'll be fine. You kill all the germies. And then you'll be fine. Also, try not to touch your face. Then I want a present. You can't get a present every time you wash your hands. <laughs> also, because we're not going to be grocery shopping that much, I don't want us to go too crazy with the food, okay? Then I ain't singing if I ain't getting a present. <laughs> fine, I'll give you a little present, okay? I'll, I'll give you a, a dollar every time you wash your hands for the right amount of time. Is that a good deal? Eventually, you'll have enough to buy yourself a new video game. Happy birthday to me. <laughs> exactly. See, you get the hang of it. Good job. That's exactly what you need to do. So this also means you can't go around Timmy's house anymore, okay? You could call him on the phone. You could, you could talk to him on the computer, but you can't go to his house. My mom smells like we. Happy birthday to me. Did you just ask me? You know, as long, whatever it takes for you to wash your hands for 20 seconds, I don't care what kind of songs you come up with. Press in, please. All right, all right, all right. I said I would give you a dollar, so here you go. Your first dollar. There. Are you happy you got a dollar now? <laughs> all right, come on then. I'm going to make bank during this period of time. Oh, yeah, okay, good. <laughs> all right, so... You know, this means you can't leave the house. So, um, since it's the first day in lockdown, I'm just going to let you do whatever you want. But starting tomorrow, we're going to have to follow a routine. I'm going to wake you up. No, not Fortnite. Not yet. Let me finish talking. You're going to wake up at 8 o'clock in the morning. We're going to have breakfast. I'm going to homeschool you guys. And then after you've done all your schoolwork, you're free to do whatever you want. Okay? School? Yes. School. You still have to learn. 
No, mate. <laughs> Just a little bit of schoolwork. Nothing crazy. You're having a laugh. <laughs> no, I'm not having a laugh. You've got to still be learning. We don't know how long this could last. It could be a month, two months, three months. Who knows? But no matter how long it lasts, we're going to follow the rules. And I'm going to be your teacher. That's pretty cool, right? You get to go to school in your PJs every day. Yay! I'd rather get sick than learn. <laughs> no, you would not. Ah! We're not allowed to leave the house, baby bigs. So you're only allowed to stay in the front yard and the backyard. You're not allowed to leave the house. And if you see someone walking by, you got to stay at least two meters away from them. Okay? Uh, did you just lock... Did you just try to lock me out of the house? You little rascal. Ugh. All right, so go on. Play your Fortnite if you want. You could talk to Timmy. I'm going to call Samantha, and I'm going to ask her what she's going to be doing about this whole situation. What's Ellie doing? She's sleeping. <sighs> this girl. She's going to drive me crazy. She's my daughter, and I love her. Okay, so we've told the kids what they need to do. It's only the first day, so I'm pretty sure it's going to be easy peasy. I just, I wonder what's going to happen like a week from now. Oh, I think it's time for me to have a little nap. It's been a really stressful day and hearing all this news, I just need a little peace of mind. So you know what? I'm just going to close my eyes for a little bit, relax, and that's it. Huh? Wait, oh, no, what does this kid want? Wait, baby Bix, what are you doing? <laughs> I'm bored. It's been 10 minutes. How are you bored? I didn't even get to fall asleep yet. And I'm glad you're wearing a mask. That's very good. <laughs> but you don't need to have one in the house. There's no need for it. I don't want to get infected by you guys. <laughs> I'm not a walking disease, okay? And if you're bored, go outside and play in the backyard. I spent a lot of money in that backyard, so... Well, you look like one. Oh, I don't look like a disease. Look, come on. Did you guys forget that you guys have an amazing backyard? Most kids would dream of having a backyard that you guys have. Look, come here. You want me to go outside? Not outside, in the backyard. Not outside, outside. Just in our own property. It'll be fine. You're allowed to go in your backyard. You could go kick a ball or something. Oh, your mom's got good skills. Check her out. I'm like messy out here. Look at me. Woo. You're just, nope, not impressed. They, my kids don't even care. Nope. They just, nope, nothing. What are you doing? What, what are you wearing? <laughs> you look like you're wearing a full on like hazmat suit. What is this? You know, you're just going to the backyard. I need protection. All right, come on. Your sister's sleeping, by the way, so shh. Be quiet. No, don't go bother her, okay? She's going through a little phase. All right, look. You are so lucky to have a backyard like this. How could you say you're bored? You've got a swimming pool. Look at that playground. It is amazing. It's better than some parks. And you're saying you're bored. Go build a stand castle. You got a trampoline. I could push you on the swings. Wait, baby Biggs? Where did you go? Baby Biggs, you're not allowed outside the house property. Oh, you broke the rules. You're going to get arrested. Okay, look. See, just stay inside the fence, okay? Then you're allowed to do whatever you want. Build a stand castle. Look, 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 look at this. Ready? Watch this. I'm going to go down the slide. Woo! <laughs> play by myself well yeah no football there's a football inside you go grab it look you got a football net over here see this you could i, I could be your goalkeeper Mm-hmm. isn't this good could go for a swim like you've got so much stuff to do how could you be bored on the first day of lockdown it's all right I'm just going to go in and play Fortnite. No, uh, 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 no. Look, we don't know how long this, this whole thing is going to last. And we can't just be lazy in the house. We've got to exercise. You've got to gotta stay moving. you got to keep your mind sharp. You can't just sit and play video games all day. You can for a little while, but not all day, okay? 
We're going to have to have a routine, remember? Exercise, study. You could still play your Fortnite. Talk to Timmy. You don't even exercise. Ah! You don't need to expose me like that. Okay, fine. You know what? Get inside. Go, 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 go. Get inside. Oh, this is going to be a very, very stressful time as a single mom with two kids. Let me just tell you that right now. In the comments down below, please let me know if you guys have any ideas that I could do with the kids during this time, especially with Ellie. I feel like Baby Bix is going to be fine. You know, he's got his video games and stuff, but I don't know what I'm going to do with Ellie. She won't talk to me, and now, like, what are we going to do? Live in silence for a month? I don't know. Maybe I should call Natty's mom. You know, she's the one that forged my signature and allowed Ellie to get this belly button piercing. Maybe... Maybe it's just time to confront this whole issue. I don't know. But let me know in the comments down below if you guys have any fun activities I could do with the kids. But once again, I hope you guys had fun watching. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and share. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye!